Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? I'm Inezlea, and welcome to the CreatorGalaxy.com space station. Here in space, we are experimenting with intergalactic filmmaking skills and visual effects. We have created a video in collaboration with Adobe, and we have added a ton of visual effects in there, which was really, really cool. And in today's video, I will be showing you one of those effects, and that's how to place a mountain in your background. So this is a footage that we have. As you can see, we have a quite bright sky and that's really good. We could also work with a blue sky where we could key out. Basically what I'm going to try and do is remove the background, add in a mountain and then put the background back there in its place. So I will drag this into a new composition and then I will go to edit, duplicate, and then I will go to effects, color correction, and I will add the colorama effect. Here I want to go to the output cycle and change this to a ramp gray. I will add in a black point here and a white point here. And bring these closer together just to get only a white sky and black threes. So we can maybe fade this off a little bit and this is looking all right, maybe a little bit closer. There we go. Next, we want to toggle this off so we don't see it. And now we want to look for a mountain. So I will be using Adobe's integrated tool for Adobe Stock in Adobe After Effects. So I will go to Window, Libraries, which is right here for me, and I will search for mountain. And I want to use the filters, photos. Once you're satisfied with your footage, you can go in here and license it. You can go ahead and confirm it. and drag in the new version, which is actually a lot bigger. So we have to now scale it back down. Even smaller. We have all that detail there. I really do like the sky here. So I'm just going to scale it up to fit the top part here and just try to put it in position. Another thing that I like to do is right here on the trees, you kind of see a little bit of spill. So I will go back to that set extension, play a little bit more with the white until we have that cut off a little bit better. And then I want to click and create a new solid layer. Take some kind of hazy color, maybe a little bit more to the white part. Click OK. Duplicate that set extension with the colorama by going to edit, duplicate and bring that on top of that solid layer we just created and also make this a luma matte. And here we want to press T on the keyboard and just lower the opacity. This is going to create kind of a haze uh, in the background because if you look at mountains in the far, far distance, you will see that it's not very contrasty and it kind of has a haze to it. We can also go to our mask tool and choose a rectangle tool, choose the top part and subtract this layer, press F on the keyboard and feather it quite a bit. So we just have the haze here on the bottom. And there we have it. We now have some really nice mountains in our background. All right, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, take care and goodbye. <laughs>